Hello everyone. Let me help you analyze CBSE Science Class 10 Sample Question Paper Term 2 for the academic year 2021-22. Here in this video, we shall deal with physical sciences part of the question paper. This sample question paper is provided by CBSC. This is available on CBSC academic website and is also provided in the link below. Taking a closer look at question number one, the question is testing the knowledge of the student on the electronic configuration of groups. We are here given group number six, one, seven and eight. This includes the element's capability of bonding and being inert. While preparing the question paper here for class 10, term 2, the teachers must also consider the essential concepts science issued by the CBSE board. For this question, carbon and its components, carbon and its compounds are to be taken into consideration. It is very clearly mentioned in this essential concept about the carbon atoms attaining stability and forming covalent bonds, tetravalency as well as catenation forming double and triple bonds. If a teacher and a student can prepare for the examination with the help of this essential concept and also keep the sample question paper it is easy for the student to understand the connectivity between the questions and the answers to be given. Question number two deals with periodic table. This question emphasizes on the 3D visualizing skills of a student. The importance of placing an element in the periodic table to form a covalent compound. This question is very clear showing the periods and groups. Student must be aware of concepts of gradation of atomic radius in the group as well as in the period. The properties of atomic radius are taken into consideration while answering this question. Once again, going back to the periodic classification of elements in the essential concept, it clearly states here that in the modern periodic table, elements are arranged in the increasing order of their atomic numbers, the metallic character, the period and group which an element belongs to indicate the electronic configuration of the atoms of the element and how the metallic character increases down a group and decreases across a period. Taking a closer look at the marking scheme, the marks are divided into half a mark as well as one mark. Mapping Bloom's taxonomy onto the assessment objectives 1, 2, 3 and 4. Remembering and understanding questions fall into the category of assessment objective 1 and 30% of the questions appear from this section. Application part of the questions are under assessment objective 2, wherein 30% of the questions appear under this section assessment objective 2. If a question looks for remembering, understanding and application part of it, half mark is being awarded in the marking scheme. Whereas, as per the Bloom's taxonomy, if the components fall under analyze, evaluate and create segment, one mark is awarded for such kind of question. Analysis is falling under assessment objective three as per the learner's framework of science subject. Assessment objective four consists of evaluate and create questions which form only 20% of the question paper. Therefore, assessment objective one, 
assessment objective 2 is 30 percent assessment objective 3 is 20 percent and assessment objective 4 is 20 percent again coming to question number six that is physics question effect of magnetic field in an electric circuit is tested here presence of a horseshoe magnet makes a difference in an electric field Fleming's left hand rule should be followed here the current and magnetic field are perpendicular to each other hence Fleming's left hand rule goes good the second part of the question also uses Fleming's left hand rule the student can answer that the current and the magnetic field components cannot be parallel according to Fleming's left hand rule question number six the alternative question is also an extension of simple circuit negative end of the battery connected to the coil behaves like a north pole of a bar magnet lines of force move from north pole to south pole inside the coil the lines of force move from south pole to north pole closer lines of force will definitely indicate the strength of the magnetic field is higher and the lines apart will show that the magnetic field is weak the essential concepts class 10 science issued by cbsc has its component of magnetic effect of electric current there are six points under this magnetic effect of electric current the question number six and its alternative compound covers all the components in the magnetic effect of electric current essential concepts it discusses about the magnetic field around a current carrying conductor circular loop of current resemble those of a bar magnet the strength of magnetic field the presence of magnetic substance and the magnetic field exerting a force on a current carrying conductor these are the important concepts here question number eight is much much similar to question number two allotropy might not be covered under the syllabus for class 10 physical science but catenation is always there in the syllabus therefore let us look at the formation of diamond due to catenation and tetravalency and why is mentioned in question number two about sulfur and the same concept is present here in question number eight observing the question paper is very important question paper is also considered as a source of learning for the students question number nine spatial skills are questioned here the 3d view of these isomers to from functional isomers is questioned here as a help to all the students the teachers can emphasize that carbon is asked then definitely tetravalency and catenation covalent bonding should come into their minds question number 11 focuses on units kilowatts hours for electric energy it's very important to note down the units which are emphasized here that solves the problem here and in question number 11 solving this question become much much easier once the parameters are looked for the voltage and resistance are varying here keeping current constant that's the reason using the equation power is equal to v square by r again in essential concepts class 10 science under electricity segment these are all coming under this segment current is a charge flowing through a conductor per unit time the resistance of a conductor is directly proportional to its length and inversely proportional to the cross-sectional area and the alternative question covers the resistances in series and parallel the marking scheme should be kept in mind as remember understanding and application will always consist of half mark whereas 
analyzing evaluating and creating will always carry one mark question number 12 has knowledge of concept for parallel and series resistances rest is definitely numerical calculation and ohm's law question number 15 is a magnetic induction question the focus is to be laid on whether it is a battery or a galvanometer included in the circuit there is deflection being shown in the circuit thus it becomes a magnetic induction question because it is galvanometer instead of a battery in such cases where galvanometer is included in the circuit without a battery fleming's right hand rule comes into picture The alternative question in question number 15 also forms a part of this magnetic induction. Justifying an answer come to evaluating or analyzing the question definitely it will be for one mark. This is a comprehensive analysis of the sample question paper provided by the cbsc for term 2 for the academic year 2021-22 i wish all the teachers and the students all the best for the examination forthcoming hope you find this video helpful please share it to your friends like and subscribe this channel more videos will be posted to help you all score a perfect 10